Hey what's up people this is Tommy from War with PC channel in this video I'm gonna show you people how to record gameplays in your PC I have been trying to do this uh, for a long time because uh, uh, but I couldn't be able to do that because uh, I couldn't be able to uh, find a proper software to record uh, our gameplays so here is a software called Action uh, which is really very pretty cool and uh, it got a uh, lot of uh, pretty options so uh, let me show you what are the things that uh, it can be done uh, to uh, get a proper gameplay recording. Yep, uh, this is the UI of the software. And uh, here we got uh, three options. Uh, one is a uh, gameplay recording and then active desktop recording and then uh, a particular region where you can uh, record or uh, get a screenshot or whatever things that you want. And uh, this is for uh, gameplays, and uh, the both works for the gameplays. And uh, when when you click on this, particularly, you can uh, record uh, the desktop as well as uh, your gameplay. So it's always pretty cool to have this one. And uh, there's a shortcut keys uh, where you can uh, save time by knowing the shortcut keys. And uh, if you have to know even more about shortcut keys, yeah, here are the list they have. Uh, given and if you want to uh, uh, disable it any of the short key short keys that uh, you can just uncheck it but uh, these four are the default ones and uh, you cannot uh, do anything with that and check or check is always uh, default and the next thing what it comes here is a uh, frame rate uh, frame rate is uh, it depends uh, mostly on uh, what kind of graphic card you have uh, if you have a better graphic card you can always go with uh, 60 uh, video frame per uh, second but uh, if you think uh, your uh, recording or gameplays are uh, uh, kind of a uh, bit uh, lagging kind of stuff so you can always uh, reduce to the suitable level that uh, it always suits you and uh, you know they always have to give a recording in order to uh, record your microphone and uh, here is uh, something other thing called uh, duration uh, where you can uh, set the time limit of the recording or gameplay all of those kind of stuff but uh, i don't think uh, this is much useful when uh, you are playing uh, you are recording a whole lot of uh, lengthy video so this is that uh, for uh, of the recording that you need to know but uh, when it comes to audio uh, there is uh, not much of uh, doing in this space but uh, in here this audio tab contains something called uh, microphone volume as well as system sounds because when you're recording a gameplay it, it, these two options are always overlap with each other either you want your uh, your own voice to be the high than your uh, system sounds so you just have to increase it and in case if you want your system audio which means the gaming audio as well uh, you can adjust according to that and then uh, you can record your gameplay uh, this is always very much important in order to get your user's attention or uh, or like your videos and if you, see, if you come to this tab uh, this is nothing but a benchmark recording which does is that uh, if you set it some particular time limit and if you play a particular game in order to check what kind of frame rate it is of recording for example I have recorded some recent uh, just my active desktop uh, recording it will open a Excel application so that um, it will show you that uh, at what frame rate it has been recorded per each second uh, here you can see um, at what uh, frame per second has been recorded on each frame per second you will calculate an average frame per second so if you see that the only maximum excuse me, uh, uh, frame, per, frame per second is that um, this 24 all those things because uh, that is where the movement has been taking place in your my active desktop so uh, this is it uh, this is about the uh, benchmarking so in order to test your video recording and it also has a screenshot uh, application I mean uh, uh, availability so so what you just, if you want uh, any screenshot you can just hit on that F12 button and then it will take a screenshot for you and all these options only available when you click on that active desktop but these options are also available when you click on this game application while you're running a game or any kind of things but only thing you need to know is uh, to uh, remember this uh, shortcut keys to whenever you're recording your gameplay 
most of the settings that uh, you can do it by yourself and uh, you just go to the setting and uh, do all those kind of stuff that you want to do for your suitable recording and you can always have this uh, video quality low and high so it depends on your uh, I mean the uh, speed and the uh, decoding all kind of uh, stuff memory so uh, yep uh, this is it uh, signing off uh, from this video right now and I uh, hope you like this video and uh, if you do please uh, hit that like button and then if you have any other doubts or queries you can comment on my uh, this video uh, I will reply so yep uh, thanks for watching see you next video